so we've advanced to the 200 ton stamping press so I've got Caitlin mastered the small one and now we are on to the big press so we're able to do these a lot more efficiently here's what we're making right now so this one is these are pretty thick these happen to be 16 gauge just because we have a bunch of it so she's running these so how's it look perfect So we're hitting it with about a hundred tons right now. And we can get them in a single blow. They look really crisp. So she's just, we've got her all trained up on this one. So we're finishing, we're doing all these in sets of three so every bag has three of them and they are they'll be all up on Friday after we finish this stamping here that we're working on these are more that we're doing uh, we're gonna switch over to sterling silver Let me shut this off yeah we're gonna switch over and we're gonna do some stuff in sterling I've got a bunch of sterling silver that we're going to melt down and roll and um, we'll do, I'll pick out something to do in sterling. Let's kind of go look at that. Do you got enough to keep you going here for a little bit? I think, yeah, you're good. Seven more? Okay. So what we're doing is we're doing a run of 20 bags of each. So there's three in each bag and then we just put it away because... We're going to try to, uh, my goal is to run every single one of these. It could take us the rest of our lives. <laughs> but right now, we're going to pick something out to do in Sterling. I'm going to see what we find. I want to do something really cool. So I'm not sure what it is yet. If anyone's got any suggestions for stuff... I'm not going to do anything that we have done before or that we've made a die from. I don't want to compete with you guys on your stampings. So everything we do will be stuff that's never been available. Yeah, here's the dies from these. I put them back. So we did Athena and we did this one here. I actually have the Galvano for that. It was a large Galvano. It's really cool. It came with this company when we bought all these parts, or all these dies. It's hard to tell what some of this stuff is. I don't know, that's kind of neat. So I'm thinking of doing it in sterling. Maybe we could, I don't know, does anybody want Western stuff? I know we can, we can definitely do some dragons. I'll definitely do some of that. But we could do conchos. I, I don't want to do these giant buckles. They're a pain. There's a little placeholder one. Um, oh, yeah, it's a bird. Let's see. What could we do in silver that would be kind of fun? Maybe some of these might be good. I'm going to pull some stuff, take a picture of it. I'm going to take a picture of like three or four different items. And we'll 
we'll pre-order it. Like we'll see how many people want, you know, uh, some conchos or how many want some Art Nouveau stuff. How many people want dragons. I'll eventually get to doing rings for you guys. But we've, we've shared a lot of the rings with you guys, so I don't want to compete with anybody. So if somebody's decided they're going to make rings for a living, I don't want to stand in your way. So, what are we, these are all little buckles and stuff. They're really pretty. That's pretty neat. These are, uh, it's a match safe. London Bridge. We have all kinds of nonsense. Let's go in here and see what we've got. What was I can't I was coming in here for something, but I kind of totally spaced it. These are all rings. This is all rings. I'm gonna I've got something working on these. I'm I'm mulling something over a an idea so that you guys can produce these kind of rings without being on the struggle bus for this style of stuff. I've almost got it figured out what I need to do. So, I think, let's go look down. Oh, I know what I came in here to look at. Ugh. We're gonna pick out some sterling stuff. Anybody for, I'm gonna, I'll pull some of this stuff out that I think is pretty awesome that we can run in the uh, in the stamping press. A lot of this stuff's really cool. It make great pieces. I'm kind of leaning towards this thing. This is really nice. I bet it's great. It's really just got grease on it and it's dirty, but. That's probably a super nice piece. That might be a good one. What else we got? Let's go down a drawer. That would be very pretty too. As would. Oh, that one's a messed up one. Some of these are amazing. So I, th I think what I'll do is I'm going to pull a couple of these. Uh, look at that belt tip. If you guys were into making this kind of stuff, this is like the holy grail of Western stuff. Uh, let's go down another one. What do we got? This one's good too. So what I'll do is I'll probably do a run of some of this stuff and we will uh, we'll fly through it. I'll do them all in sterling so that they shine up really well and they're super strong. They'll probably, they won't be super cheap unfortunately because they, I'll probably do them, you know, reasonably heavy because they're going to be really pretty. So here's the top die of this one. Here's your top and bottom. I'm gonna do this one. So yeah, we'll do this one. That'll look great. We're gonna run some of those. So I'll take a picture of some of this stuff and we'll put it up. It'll be in sterling silver today. I'll show you guys in a little bit. Take it easy.